Hello, and thank you for choosing Law Ruler, the first end-to-end -end growth suite, built with your growth in mind. Today we're going to go over how to create custom reports. Follow along with me as I guide you through the process. Alright, let's go ahead and get started. The first step is to navigate to reports located on the left-hand menu. Once inside of reports, in the first column, we're going to go ahead and select Custom Report Builder. All right, the next step is to scroll down to customize your report. This is where we are going to select our fields for our custom report. You can start off by selecting the default fields available in your Law Ruler account, such as first name, last name, phone, basic contact information, and dates. Once you select the ones you want, you can select multiple by clicking Control and selecting different ones or if they're all in a row, you can select the first one, hold shift, and select the last one in the sequence that you'd like to select. Once all of the information you'd like is selected, you can go ahead and remove it from this side over to the selected field side with the arrow. That will go ahead and add these columns to your report. If you'd like to pull specific columns from your intake questionnaires on your case types, you can scroll down to type case. Under type case, you can select which case types intake you would like to pull columns from. Let's go ahead and select all. So for this intake, I could select the question, who is the other driver? If I'd like that metric to be on the report, I simply click and use the arrow key to move it over to my selected field side. If I made a mistake and need to put a field from this side back into the queue to remove it from my report, I simply click here, use the arrow key to move it over. You would also notice that there are other two arrow keys here with two different arrows pointing in either direction. This will either move all fields from the left to the right or all fields from the right to the left. Once you have your selected fields the way you would like your report to be on your layout, you can go ahead and scroll down. You are now ready to name your layout. For this one, we're going to go ahead and name it Test Layout 1. Then you can choose if it's either just for yourself or if you'd like it to be available for all users on your portal, you can click this button. Once you're done, go ahead and hit Save. You're going to see a confirmation message at the top of the screen saying the layout was created successfully, go ahead and hit OK. Once you have saved your new layout, your next step is going to be to go ahead and select your layout from the drop-down options. Go ahead and click the drop-down up at the top where it says select your layout and find the layout you just created. For this example, we're using our test layout 1 that we just built. Below, we can now select the date fields that we would like to run the report on. Go ahead and select the month if you'd like to name it for a specific month or time frame, or you can also do custom date ranges below. Simply click on the calendar and select the date range you would like to run the report for. After selecting the date range, you can then choose to filter the report to show you the data that you would most like to target. For instance, would you only like to see cases? Go ahead and remove the check mark from leads and intakes. The available filters you can see here are tags, case type, firm, assignee, source, status, owner, and language. After you have successfully filtered your report, you now have two options to move forward. If you would like an immediate report with the information selected, go ahead and click Export to Excel. That will run the report right now and you will be able to access it. If you would like to schedule it for a later date, go ahead and select Schedule Report. This will allow you to automate the delivery of this report to your email on either a daily, weekly, monthly, or bi-weekly time frame. You can also select which time you would like it to be delivered. Simply place your email address that you would like to be delivered to in this box and hit save. And that concludes how to build a custom report in your Law Ruler portal. As always, thank you for choosing Law Ruler. If you have any support questions, we are always happy to help. You are welcome to contact us by email at support at lawruler.com. You can also access our Law Ruler support forum at support.lawruler.com. For those of you who want to make changes to Law Ruler but simply don't have the time, 
let our expert staff do the work for you. We offer Done For You Consulting, a service that is billed hourly and available for your convenience. Please contact your account manager to learn more. Thank you again for your time, and from everyone here at the Law Ruler family, we hope you have an amazing day.